Hey, welcome to Golf Beginner World. I appreciate you being here. Keeping the club on the correct plane during the backswing and especially during the downswing is essential for more consistency and good ball contact. Now, if you're not sure if you're on plane on the way down, is your club head slightly outside the plane? Might it be too far inside? That can also happen. That's also wrong. All you've got to do is to make a super slow, slow motion swing. Okay, so let me explain. So after taking your stance, make your back swing. That's where you'll see if your club head's too flat on the way back. You can correct that immediately. That just makes the rest of the swing a lot easier. You'll be able to see if you're swaying during the back swing or if you're turning your shoulders around your spine. This is what you want. You want your weight to be on the inside of your right foot. So whenever I notice my students are off plane, I can see it, but I want them to see it. Then I let them do the slow motion swing. It's important to have the ball there as a point of reference. Okay, so on the downswing, for players that are swinging out to in or hitting sockets, they all of a sudden notice that before hitting the ball, the club head is on the outside of the ball, which isn't good. They can also see that the hands are too far from their bodies. And they can also see that they've turned their lower body insufficiently. A lot of my better students notice how their club head stays way behind them, how stuck they are, and how they come into this position. Then all of a sudden, they understand what I'm trying to tell them. And it's interesting, when they start swinging the club on the right plane during the downswing, all of a sudden, they begin to transfer their weight to the left. Because those golfers that turn too early don't really transfer their weight. I tell them to feel the impact position with the hips open and the shoulders straight and their hands forwards and then I say okay make a few really slow swings and do the same with the ball and what happens of course they repeat their typical swing and I tell them the club head is way too far forwards and this time they believe me so they make a few more slow motion swings and this is what you should do and they feel it and they repeat the swing with the ball. It's super simple. I'm not sure you've done it yet. You can do it right now at home. You don't have to hit a ball or on the driving range. And I think that will help you play more consistent golf. Please subscribe if you like my channel and thumbs up would be great. See you soon, hopefully.